So today we're working on a mud mask for the hair and scalp and also for the beard and the face as well. So the mud should be pretty much ready and all we're going to do now is we're going to add that mud to the areas that require the attention. In fact I need a little bit more uh, time on this, just a little bit, and then we'll be ready to go. So I'm working it into the scalp area and that's the key. I in fact need a little bit more water here just to make it a little thinner and easier to uh, apply. It's almost like a little mud, mud uh, zone in here. Your own little mud bath. And here we go. And you can apply it to the hair as well. Because what will happen is if you can get into the scalp, it doesn't hurt the hair. In fact, the hair will come out shiny and clean. It'll be detoxified as well from anything that's in there. Works out really well in that sense. So I'm just working it in into the areas where I figure it's closest to the scalp. So I'm not really worried about the hair as much as I'm trying to get it into the scalp area. And you end up looking really great like a zombie for uh, Halloween. So that's another option. <laughs> but in the meantime, this is one of the best things you can do for an exfoliation as it will cover all of the key skin areas where you end up having a lot of excess oil. It takes a couple minutes to put it into the, make sure you get it into the skin of the scalp. And while we're at it, we'll start working into the beard. Get the added benefit of a full head mud mask. This uh, clay is glacial clay with whatever essential oil or ingredient that you prefer, depending on what it does. Rose, for instance, is really good for refining the skin. Lavender is a relaxing, calming, soothing treatment. Unscented is great for people with sensitive skin who don't want anything added except for the high premium grade, uh, premium quality clay which comes from mountains, as opposed to most other clay comes from marine clay, because it's easier for them to get to. We actually hand harvest our clay from the mountains of BC, within 500 kilometers of Vancouver. We have mountain locations that we hand harvest it, and then process it. So you're getting a premium grade of glacial clay, mixed with whatever premium item, a natural ingredient or essential oil, is your preference. A lot of people with acne, for instance, like tea tree, because it's good at disinfecting. We have a, a new beer mud mask, which is really good for the skin. Good at detoxifying. So now we pretty much have, I've already got way more mud than I need. Um, I just wanted to make sure that I could do it quick and easy. So if you have excess mud, you can just let it dry out and you can use it again next time. So now we have a, a full head mud mask for beard, spa mud mask from Glacier Spa Mud for the beard, the face, and also for uh, the scalp. We're in uh, drying time right now, which will take 10, 15 minutes, depending on how far into the uh, skin. It doesn't have to be perfectly dry. But the idea is to let the electric um, negative charge start to draw in the positive charge and the little particles of clay will start to suck in all of the toxins and detoxification will occur in that period. So you don't have to wait for it to be perfectly dry, just making contact is the start of the process. And then the longer it's there, the more effective it is. Oh, and by the way, our location today is a nice hot sunny deck in October, almost uh, November. We're Halloween weekend right now and uh, 20 degrees Celsius in Vancouver, this is unheard of, so it's just magical.